Hi guys, this is Heidi with Kiddos Corral and I'm starting another week of meal inspiration videos for you guys. These are just videos, small clips that I put together that shows exactly what we eat this week. Sometimes I share breakfast, sometimes I share lunch, um, but whenever I'm making a pretty big substantial meal for my family, I always share it in a video. So tonight is Sunday. And if you're new to my channel, welcome. And, uh, you know, hit that subscribe button. I would love for you to come and join in on my kiddos corral family. So tonight I have decided just to keep it very, very simple. We have had a super busy weekend. We are putting in a brand new bathroom. And it has been a lot more work than we had anticipated. We also have been uh, tearing down uh, interior doors and putting up new doors plus I had this new stove delivered this week and just had a lot of busyness going on so if you guys know what I'm talking about you know hit that like button let me know you guys understand life is busy <laughs> Sometimes you just have to, you know, make something very simple for dinner. So tonight I have decided, it keeps looking like it's going to rain outside. It's actually cooled down a good bit. Um, this is probably not something you want to cook if it's super, super hot outside. But it is evening. It's dark, getting dark outside. And so I decided I would make a really simple chili. This is so simple, like beyond simple. I just browned, you can use ground beef. I've even used venison if I have it on hand. But tonight I'm just use ground turkey. I browned that with some onion and a little bit of bell pepper. I add in two cans of kidney beans and a can of tomato soup. And then um, I add a little bit of water because we like, now some people when they have their chili, they like it real thick and we like ours with uh, like a little bit more liquid, I guess, on it to eat it more like a soup style. And then I add just a McCormick chili seasoning packet. And of course, I don't even buy the McCormick brand. I buy the Aldi brand and I just buy the, you know, the cheapest thing there is. And I don't buy the hot. I just buy the original so it pleases everybody's palate. And that is what we're having for dinner. Now, usually if I had a little more time and felt up to it, I would probably make some cornbread to go with this. But tonight I just don't feel like it. So we're just going to have some crackers and we're just going to have some chili and we're just going to relax the rest of the evening. I hope you all are doing great on this Sunday or whenever you see this video. And I'll be seeing you all tomorrow night for another meal hi guys it is Monday and today I made spinach lasagna rolls and we are pairing it with a Caesar salad and that is what we're having for dinner I did a cook with me video on the spinach rolls and I hope you all enjoy seeing that video um, I think it'll come out before um, before this video so I will link the link for that video down below so you guys can catch that and get the recipe I cannot wait to dive in it smells so so fantastic right now so we'll see you tomorrow night for another dinner hello friends it is Tuesday I had to think for a minute what is today today is Tuesday I had a lot of veggies I needed to use up so they wouldn't go bad so I've got zucchini squash in here and I just cubed it and then um, I put olive oil salt and pepper clavenders which is the Greek seasoning that we use on everything I've showed it before in a lot of my vlogs and some um, Parmesan cheese and then we have the tilapia which is just with uh, butter lemon and pepper and a little bit of salt and I just made a simple rice and that is what is for dinner tonight this is going to get devoured. This looks so good right now. <laughs> Hi guys, it is Wednesday and I wanted to share with you what we're having for supper. I'm eating by myself right now, but my gang of guys are headed home. We have some garlic and parsley. Uh, these are just chicken breasts that I cut in half because they were so big. Um, they were cooked in olive oil, garlic, parsley and as well as my clavender's greek seasoning that we love so much we've got some french style green beans and some mashed potatoes and gravy and that is my dinner tonight looks pretty good to me i can't wait to dive in because i'm really hungry too
Hi guys, it is Saturday and I almost forgot to even share with you what we are having for dinner tonight and we already ate but I was about to put the leftovers up and I wanted to quickly show you guys that I made a giant crock pot full of, let me get my spoon so you guys can see what it looks like, of taco soup. It is super easy, super delicious. And we have plenty of leftovers for tomorrow, which is very exciting. And I serve this with cheddar cheese and some sour cream. And we also have them with have it with tortilla chips. And that is how I serve it. It is super, super delicious. And all of my kids love it. So tonight we're having taco soup. Hi guys, it is Sunday uh, afternoon, late afternoon, and we are having grilled burgers that we did on the grill, and then uh, Dylan put some cheese on some, and some without cheese, because we're all not cheese fans. And we did, or I did, some mushrooms and sauteed onions, and we're just going to use this Italian um, salad mix for lettuce, and we have mustard, mayonnaise, ketchup and then we bought these buns from Audi uh, with the sesame seeds on it and that is what we are having for dinner today hello friends it is uh, let's see what is today today is Monday um, it doesn't seem to be possible that my weekend went by so quickly but yes it is Monday so I made some Italian chopped salad which is very very delicious and I just made it um, I made the uh, grilled chicken breast with barbecue sauce and that is it very simple very easy but yet very delicious